Hi everyone, you might have seen last week that I put a poll on my community page. I asked you guys what resin update you were keen to see the most. Now although there was a clear winner in Angel, there was still some interest in some of the others. So in this week's episode, we're going to take a look back at some of my castings, including the strawberry and the grape, the potato chip, the 12 month old egg, the water doorknobs, and one of my favourites, the Star Trek ship in a bottle. So sit back and relax, and let's get started. So first up, we have the strawberry and the grape. Now these were first poured on the 10th of December, 2021. Well, as you just saw, apart from losing their color, they looked quite good. But how do they look now, 319 days later? Now although there was some suggestion that there was still enough oxygen inside the fruit to cause them to decompose, it hasn't quite happened yet, so we might have to save these ones for another update. Next up is the potato chip. Now this was a real fun one. My dad found this chip in the shape of a heart and he told me he was going to sell it on eBay, but luckily for me he let me cast it, so on November 26, 2021, that's what I did. So now, 334 days later, this is how it looks. Considering this chip is nearly 12 months old, it still looks as good as the day I cast it. Next up is the 12 month old egg. Now I wasn't too sure whether I was going to include this one, but after seeing how much interest it got on the poll, I felt like I had to. Now if you guys have seen the original video, you'll know what I'm talking about. So on the 2nd of April 2020, I cast the original egg, and then on April 2nd 2021, I decided to cut it open. Now in hindsight, that probably wasn't the best move, so on April 3rd 2021, I decided to recast it again. And now, 571 days later, let's see how it looks. As you can see, it's a bit dusty. I had this thing hiding in the corner of my workshop. I kind of didn't want to see it. Well, as you can see, not much has changed. It still looks like shit. Next on the list are my water doorknobs. Now this one got voted second on the poll. Now I think the reason for that is because I used my aquarium water. So we were kind of thinking that I might have trapped some bacteria and that they might grow some algae. Now I first poured these on the 29th of July, 2022.
Are you guys ready for this? 91 days later. Let's take a look. Well, they almost look as good as the day I cast them, except for this one here. I've noticed that there's a crack running up the inside of the glass. Now, it doesn't look like it's causing me any problems. There's definitely no water leaking, so I think we'll be okay. So I guess we're all a bit surprised that these didn't grow anything, but I think the reason for that is because these don't see any sunlight. So I think what I might do is take one of these knobs and leave it on the windowsill, and then we'll check back a few months later and see if we can get anything to grow. Next up is one of my all time favourites, my first Star Trek ship in a bottle. I poured this one on the 1st of December 2019. Now I think the reason that this is one of my all time favourites is it's the first time that we discovered a happy little accident. There was air trapped inside the model and when the resin cooled down it caused a fracture and it made it look like an explosion. This one is the oldest one yet. It's been 1059 days since I made it. Let's take a look. Well, as you can see, this project looks just as good as the day I finished it. Considering I haven't given it a polish since, I think it looks really good. It's now time for the last project. It's time to see Angel. I lost my pet angelfish on the 16th of July 2022 and I decided to cast him the very next day. So there's been a lot of talk about this one. There was a lot of suggestions saying that I should have prepared him a little better, maybe soaked him in alcohol or things along those lines so that he wouldn't decay or turn to goo. Well, it's now been 101 days, so let's see how he looks. Well, I'm happy to say that Angel looks just as good as the day I put him in there. Apart from maybe losing a little colour, he looks perfect. Well, that's it for this week's episode. I hope you enjoyed this one. If there are any past projects that you want to see an update on, let me know. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time.